Hello, my stamping friends. This is Renee Novak at BlessedByCards.com. I'm an independent Stampin' Up! demonstrator in the United States, and I'm here today with another Make It Monday tutorial. Today, we're going to create this cute little Halloween card using the cutest Halloween set, the banner year set, and the punch and the top of the jar from the jar of jar of flowers stamp set. So we're not going to actually create this card today because it did take me some time to do it, but I want to walk you through it. So the supplies you're going to need basically are pumpkin pie, basic black, and basic white. The ink is basic black memento and also pumpkin pie, and then the outline of the pumpkin is garden green. I brought this little... Um, template to show you because of all the pieces that I cut and created my card with I have different measurements on the back so that I can share them with you I will also have a free PDF download of all the measurements and directions on how to create this card so very simply I cut a 2 inch strip by 11 and then from that 2 inch strip I cut a piece of 3 which is your biggest piece that measures your jar. And then I cut a piece of two and a half, and that was this card with the two little pumpkins and the spider. That was also two inches. It was two by two and a half. The next one was two by one and a half, and that was the cute little trick or treat, or this is the other one I was deciding on when I couldn't decide which one to go with. And then I cut a strip that measured seven and eight by one and three fourths. So really it was seven eighths by two inches because that's how wide this was. But I cut it down to one and three fourths. So you'll have a little bit of this left. And then you have a two by two inch square left over from whatever you want to use. So again, all these measurements and cutting directions will be on my blog. And so basically what I did was I took those white card stocks and those were the ones and you know they're just all laid out here if they were blank I have my measurements on the back but then all I did was just stamp them however I wanted this the only different thing I did with this one is I punched out the jar and I stamped the candy corn in the jar I stamped the the canning lid and I did take a black marker and went around just to give a little dimension of the jar. And so that's just a black outline. That's about the only thing I did besides putting a little piece, a little bow with Baker's twine. Okay, and then I just stamped the bats and I stamped the cute little pumpkins and I stamped the boo. And then the um, if you wanted to do either the cat or you could do the ghost I couldn't decide but they're both stinking cute so anyway um, then you just kind of build it on top of a piece of black and I put it on top of there and called it a day that was my card so it really was quite easy once I figured out the measurements it didn't take any time at all so now that you can download the measurements for free and the measurements of, of what you need to cut to create your little block design it'll be simple for you so thanks for watching if you enjoyed this video please give me a thumbs up and share with your friends and um, join me next Monday for another make it Monday tutorial until then be blessed